If you work in a call center or if you do a lot of video conferencing calls or even only audio calls, then these headsets might be the option for you. It has some interesting features, but the main one is active noise cancelling. And if you are watching this video on your Windows 10 or 11 computer and you still haven't activated it and can't even edit your desktop icons, don't forget to check out cdksales.com where we can find budget official OEM keys at an affordable price. And with the coupon code that you can see on screen and down below on the video description, it will get even cheaper. The design is different from what we are used in terms of headphones. If we take a look here at the pads, uh, usually when we put it on our ears, the headset, the usual headset will block our ears, so we will not hear anything. And that's good, but at the same time, not so good. For example, to hear music, these would not be the ones that I would suggest, although the sound is good, but it does not isolate my ears, so probably not the best experience. But the advantage is, if I use these in a office environment, I can hear everything. Actually here I can listen to my own voice which is not usual when we use this kind of headset. By the way I'm using this uh, tiny obsbot to right over here which we will test out with the sound that we will be recording in just a few moments so that we can check out the active noise cancelling. It has 40 hours of battery if we use it only to hear music and 7 hours if we use it continuously with the AI active noise cancelling. Build quality is not top notch but not not bad at all, they are comfortable. We can see that they're all padded right over here on the head area, very flexible. So they will fit most of the heads. We can adjust them like this and like this, and we can also adjust this way. Besides that, uh, if we want, we can mute them. So sliding down it will unmute and we can talk and then if we want to make a break and just turn to our colleague and ask something we can and then we can keep on talking with the customer without touching any buttons. This is really awesome. It also connects to our computer Windows or Mac OS via thumb drive but we can connect via Bluetooth so we can have a maximum of two devices simultaneously connected for example a MacBook Pro and an iPhone or an Android phone whatever we want and then we can disconnect from one and connect to the other one. Now that being said let's do a test audio here and it just activated the noise cancelling so let's deactivate and let's put here some sound just as reference let's hear the sound here on my main camera and uh, at this moment let's go here to this angle pretending that I'm doing a video call I can activate the tracking of the Obsbot Tiny 2 and if I move here or move here it will track me. Now the sound that we are hearing at this moment is provided from the microphone here on the headset without active noise cancelling. So just for a sample let's pause that noise and at this moment we are using the headset to record the audio so that we can have a sample and see how it behaves on a quiet environment without active noise cancelling. Let's move to this camera and to this microphone so that we have a comparison and now let's move back to this camera and this microphone so that we can compare. Now let's put in the uh, voices background noise. This is much louder than a normal workplace but to be able to test out I believe that this will be good enough. So let's activate the noise cancelling by pressing twice here and now the active noise cancelling is on. So this is what we are hearing recorded here on the headset. If I move to this camera here using my microphone we will hear the noise, the background noise and if we move right over here we will only listen to the microphone. Now we will still be here and deactivate the active noise cancelling. So at this moment we have noise but no active noise cancelling. Let's activate it once again so that we can hear the difference and every time that we transfer from one to another I hear her voice telling me that it's on or off. So let's go off and now it's off. So I'm going to put on pause 
and this is active noise cancelling off with no sound. Okay, so probably this is an exaggerated test, but here we are with this camera and this microphone with traffic noise. And right now, let's go to this microphone and this camera with the same traffic noise and without noise cancelling on. Now, let's turn it on and see if we have a difference and if it will block also on any active noise cancelling system that I've tested it always affects our voice so we will test that as well and check out how deep it will affect or not so let's deactivate while the noise is right over there and now let's activate it once again so that we can listen we can compare right over here with this camera and this microphone and we can get back to the headset microphone actually this will be an interesting test for those that are wondering besides being able to use it as a call center microphone can i use it for my live streams my live recordings things like that probably yes so let's press it once again and now active noise is off so let's shut down the background noise one more last test with silence or the absence of noise let's deactivate or activate to be more precise and this is the active noise cancelling on and at this moment let's deactivate so at this moment no noises and active noise cancelling is off and right now let's do one more test which is the mute test so i'll keep on talking Now I will unmute so I did talk all the way through and hopefully it will block the sound. And that is it. In terms of testings, I do believe that the main features here are the active noise cancelling, the mute and unmute. And one thing that it's not usual, at least to me, is the design of the headset, which has no normal ear pads. It has these open ear pads, which for a office environment, I would say that this is a good thing. But to listen to music and be more immersed, then this would not be my choice. And I believe that that's not the target. That being said, hope that you enjoyed this video and if you know anyone that has a lot of hours in front of the screen doing video calls or audio calls or works in a call center, share this video with that person because I would love to hear some feedback, I would love to hear some opinions regarding this kind of device. What do you use on your workplace? What do you do? Do you work with software to cancel noise? Because here everything is made on the hardware side, we don't have to worry about the computer that we are using. I can just unplug the pen and take it to another computer and bam, I will have all the features there. So I'm really curious about that. Hopefully you've enjoyed the video in the video, so don't forget that usual thumbs up right over there which is really appreciated on this side of the screen. My name is Roberto George and as always, I'll see you on the next one.